In this video, I'm going to show you how to prepare a sheet pan meal in your combi steam oven. Um, however, I am going to cheat a little bit because I am using two pans, not just one. So in this meal, I have a pork tenderloin. It weighs just under a pound. And I began by searing the pork tenderloin. Um, but if you don't have time or you don't want to take that step, it's fine, just season it and then add it to the pan or cook it on a separate pan. The vegetables, to make it a, one, a quick one dish meal, should have the approximately same cooking time as the meat. Although the meat should come out a few minutes in advance so that it can rest before you slice it. So, I have um, these lovely fresh looking Brussels sprouts which I sliced and I know that way they'll cook much faster. I have some shiitake mushrooms and some petite carrots which again I've um, sliced lengthwise so I know that the approximate cooking time will be between 15 and 20 minutes. Now in my oven I have to choose the percentage of humidity that I want to use with the convection temperature but every steam oven is different. If your steam oven has a combination mode of convection and steam then that's the setting that you should use. So basically, you're cooking with convection, having the steam involved. Steam it prevents the cellular breakdown of food, and that's why you get better flavor, better texture, and most important is better nutrient value from the foods that you're cooking. So I'm using the, the default temperature in my oven is 340. It might be different in yours, probably between 330 and 350. Uh, but those temperatures will work fine. Now, I found that with pork tenderloin, you can use some high heat to give it a sear, but it's going to cook much better if you cook it at a moderate temperature. So 340 is perfect for the pork and it'll do well for the veggies. When I take the pork out a few minutes earlier, if I want some additional caramelization on my veggies, I can crank up the heat a little bit then or if your steam oven is equipped with a broil element, you can turn on the broiler and give the vegetables a little bit of sizzle. So, preparing a sheet pan meal, even cheating with two pans, is very easy in your steam oven. There's no special um, thinking involved except temperature and timing. So, in 20 minutes, here is our sheet pan, our steam oven sheet pan meal. So we have the sliced uh, Brussels sprouts and shiitake mushrooms, we have our carrots, and we have the pork tenderloin. Now I did take the pork tenderloin out of the oven after 15 minutes, and when I took them out, I boosted the temperature here um, for the vegetables to finish cooking to 400 degrees. And you can see the vegetables got a nice little bit of crispy crunchiness, and that seems to be what people really like, is a little crunch with their perfectly cooked vegetables. So. Don't be afraid to try a sheet pan meal in your steam oven following the guidelines I recommended. Um, it's going to taste just as delicious as if you cooked it in your convection oven. Um, the only limitation might be the size depending on the quantity of people that you're cooking for. Hi, I'm Larissa, your convection enthusiast. Convection cooking can make you a better cook. Check out my videos and I think you'll find that you'll do really, really well. And please like and subscribe.